Here, I will be showing you how to assemble the plane. First, turn your transmitter on. Then, find your receiver and plug all the servos into it. The elevator gets plugged into channel 2. The electronic speed controller gets plugged into channel 3. Servo splitter from the wings gets plugged into channel one. Be careful not to bend the antenna too much. Stuff, stuff the receiver down inside the plane. Then take the wings, place them on top, stuffing the wire in the plane as you go. Before you plug the battery up to the ESC, turn on your transmitter. Once your transmitter is on, you can plug the battery up to the ESC. Once the ESC has started up, you can begin to place the battery in the front of the plane. Push all wires down into the tube and make sure that they are not being crimped or bent too hard. Instead of a flap, I made a small canopy for my plane. Whichever it may be, a canopy or a flap, tape it down, and you're almost ready to fly. Just in case you're wondering, my plane is missing the rudder. It broke off during transport, but I did not have time to put it on before I completed this video. So, we will have to do without the rudder. Once the plane is successfully started up, you should now be able to use your transmitter control the ailerons and the elevator. And in order to go up, you should be able to pull down on the stick and the elevator should come up. In order to go down, you push on the right stick and the elevator should face down. In order to go left, you pull left on the right stick and the right aileron should go down and the left aileron should come up. When you first install your electronics, you may have this problem. As you can see, the elevator is reversed. When I pull down on the stick, the elevator should come up. If you have this problem, all you have to do is program your radio and reverse the channel. For this particular radio, the programming is on the computer, so I have to connect my radio via a USB port to my computer and reverse the channel from computer software. If your radio comes with a handy little screen and you can program it on there, go ahead and reverse the channel. Channel 1 is the ailerons. Channel 2 is the elevator. And channel 3 is the motor.